Hi, in this video, I am going to discuss Demultiplexer. Demultiplex means one to many. It is a reverse operation of the multiplexer. A demultiplexer is a combinational logic circuit with only one input and many outputs. It is also called as data distributor. It is a circuit that receives information on a single line and transmits this information on one of two power n possible output lines. And the selection of specific output line is controlled by the big combination of selection lines. Demultiplexing is the process that receives information from one channel and distributes the data over several channels. This is the symbol representation of demultiplexer and this is the block diagram representation. And here the input is 1 and 2 power n outputs and n number of selection lines. And similarly the block diagram representation is here. The input is one channel, the output is uh, 2 power n channels and n number of selection lines. 1 to 2 demultiplexer. From the name itself we can see the input is 1 and the output is 2. So 2 power 1 is equal to uh, 2. That means selection line is 1. The input line is 1 that is considered as D and the output line is 2. The output lines are considered as Y0, Y1. So, one selection inputs, one data inputs and two, out, um, two data outputs. This is the block diagram representation for Dmax. Now, see about the function table. Here, the selection line A and the selection line yes. The inputs are considered as 0, 1 and the outputs are Y0 and Y1. So when the selection line input is 0, the output D is selected. So the Y0 is equal to S bar D. And when the selection input S is equal to 1, the output, um, the output is equal to Y1. So, the output equation represented as y1 is equal to sd. So, this is um, this is the two table representation. Now, we will draw the logic diagram for this expressions. So, the s input is here and the complemented s input we will obtain here. So, the output y0 is equal to s bar d and here the output y1 is equal to sd. This is the logic diagram representation for 1 to 2 demultiplexer. One to four demultiplexer. In a one to four demultiplexer, there are one data input line and four output lines. So we need two selection lines to select the output line. So this is the block diagram representation. So single input D in, selection inputs A, B and the outputs are Y0, Y1, Y2, Y3. So this is the function table, the selection lines and outputs. So for uh, 0, 0 combinations, the output Y0 is selected. So the Y0 is equal to A bar, B bar, D. Next is 0, 1 combination, output y1 is selected. So, it is equal to y1 is equal to a bar b d. Next, 1, 0 combination, output y2 is selected. So, y2 is equal to a b bar d. Now, a b is equal to 1, 1. The output y3 is selected. So, y3 is equal to a b d. So, this is the uh, working of 1 to 4 multiplexer. This is the logic diagram for 1 to 4 demultiplexer. The single data input D is here. The selection input is AB. 
at this position we will get a bar b bar and the outputs are uh, represented by and gates so uh, here y naught is equal to a a bar b bar d y1 is equal to a bar b d y2 is equal to a b bar d y3 is equal to a b d so to implement the demultiplexer we required and gates and uh, inverters the one to one demultiplexer with active high enable input the enable input is here these are the selection lines single input line d and the four outputs y0 y1 y2 y3 this is the block diagram representation now the truth table the enable input is zero whatever the combination present in the selection lines the output of the demultiplexer is zero zero that is when enable input is zero the demultiplexer is deactivated and when the enable inputs are one the demultiplexer is activated so for the selection lines are zero zero combinations the output y naught is selected so the output expression at this position is e d in s1 bar s0 bar next for the zero one combinations the output y1 is selected the expression is e d1 s1 bar s0 next a one zero combination y2 is selected so the output expressions are e d1 d in s1 s0 bar next one one combinations y3 is selected the output expressions are y3 is equal to e d in s1 s0 this is the working of demultiplexer this is the logic diagram for one to one one to four demultiplexer with active high enable input the enable inputs are applied here when the enable inputs are one all the four and gates receives logic one input so the demultiplexer is activated now the single input dn is here and the selection lines s1 s0 here uh, s1 bar here s0 bar is obtained now the expression for first and gate is y not d d in s1 bar s0 bar and this is the output for y1 this and gate is output for y2 and this and gate for output y3 so this is the logic diagram representation for 1 to 4 d multiplexer 1 to 8 d multiplexer 1 to 8 d multiplexer there are one data input line and eight output lines so 2 power 3 is equal to 8 so three selection lines are uh, required to design the demultiplexer and so it distributes one input line to one of eight output lines depending on the combination of selection inputs so the output the eight outputs are y0 to y7 the three selection lines are s0 s1 s2 and the data input d in this is the block diagram representation for 1 to 8 demultiplexer this is the truth table for 1 to 8 demultiplexer the selection lines are a b c and the eight outputs are y0 to y7 now the selection lines are uh, 0 0 0 the output y0 is selected so the output expressions are represented as y0 is equal to a bar b bar c bar d this uh, product terms are implemented by and gate next is 0 0 1 combinations the output y1 is selected so the output expressions are a bar b bar c uh, d similarly all the eight outputs are uh, returned so for y7 um, the selection lines are 1 1 1 so here the output expressions are a b c d so this is the truth table representation for 1 to a d multiplexer this is the logic diagram representation for the 1 to a d multiplexer the data input is d and the three selection lines a b c and at this position we will get a bar here b bar and c bar and the product terms are um, implemented by AND gates. So this uh, first AND gate output is Y0, second AND gate is Y1, Y2, Y3, 
y4 y5 y6 y7 so this is the way we can uh, draw the logic diagram for all the uh, eight outputs design 1 to 8 demultiplexer using 2 1 to 4 demultiplexer uh, so 1 to 8 demultiplexer we have three selection lines the three selection lines are a b c then the msp bit of the selection line is a it act as an enable bit for both the multiplexer so for um, demultiplexer 1 the enable input is uh, 0 and the demultiplexer 2 the enable input is 1 that means uh, the demultiplexer 1 is working as active low enable input and demultiplexer 2 is working as active high enable input now let's see how it performs so here um, for the first uh, four outputs uh, d0 to d3 our selection uh, a that is enable input is 0 0 so when we are applying 0 0 input this um, input will become 1 so the multi multiplexer 1 is selected at the same time when uh, a is equal to 0 um, enable input to this uh, point is 0 so this demultiplexer is deactivated so for uh, a is 0 combinations so demultiplexer 1 is activated so we will obtain the output for d0 to d3 then uh, when enable input is 1 uh, this point uh, this uh, enable input of demultiplexer 1 will become 0 and enable input of demultiplexer uh, 2 is 1 so uh, when a is equal to 1 demultiplexer 2 is activated and demultiplexer 1 is deactivated so in this case we will obtain the output d4 to d7 so this is the working for uh, 1 to 8 demultiplexer using 2 1 to 4 demultiplexer 1 to 16 demultiplexer here 4 selection lines are there single input d in and 16 outputs the four selection lines are s0 s1 s2 s3 and the inputs on and the outputs are y0 to y15 and this is the logic diagram representation for 1 to 16 demultiplexer this is for output y0 this is y1 y2 and up to 15 variables are uh, represented uh, here Thank you.